today we are going to discuss about the folder that you get for unit test 1 unit test 2 and in semester examination of engineering graphics course so for engineering graphics course you have to solve the problems by using autocad and you will get such type of folder right now this is the folder for unit test 1 when you double click on the folder you will get these many files that we have instruction file then we have some drawing files so first you have to read the instructions so when you double click on the instructions so it will open and the first instruction is that you have to rename the folder with roll number name so you have to add the folder name as roll number underscore division so first we do that so i just close this file and now i am going to give the name to the file suppose my roll number is one two three four and division is a so i just right click on the folder then click on rename enter your roll number one two three four then underscore and type your division then click outside so first rename the folder with your roll number and underscore division uh, when i enter into the folder i enter read open the instruction page the second instruction is that you have to solve each question on separate answer sheet template each template should consist of correct question number and sub question number as exactly mentioned in question paper write your enrollment or prn number on add your number sheet do not write roll number on any other sheet so keep this in mind to solve extra question use sheet with name extra question and write the question number on it don't delete any file if done so the sole responsibility remain with you so you don't have to delete any file from the given folder processing and use of any kind of data transferring systems like pen drive memory card hard drive lan bluetooth devices etc is strictly prohibited and will be considered as a copy so don't carry any such things with you go on saving your files continuously for that you can use control plus yes button and after every five minutes you have to save it so saving is the whole responsibility of the candidate if you don't save the file then no one will recover it remember that retain all construction and projection lines and use the color codes as per conventions so we already discussed about the color conventions the text height including roll number so it should not be more than 4 mm any kind of inconvenience should be communicated to supervisor immediately it will not be entertained later and in such cases supervisors and subject experts decision will be final so these are the instructions so before starting you should read the instruction then close this file remain the folder and now these are the drawing files so first file is the roll number so page one is add roll number just double click on it and that add roll number file will open so here you have to add your prn number so for that you have to double click on this so it is already added there roll number prn you just double click on this and you enter into it now here you type your roll number so one two three four is my roll number so you type your roll number then click outside then double click on division and add your division my division has added as a then click outside then you can use this save button at top or you can use control yes or you can save from here okay at a we have this save option so you can use any option for the save so control is yes is a convenient option so you can use that or you can use this option for the save 
after that you close this file remember you have to open one file you have to work in that file after completion of work just close that file you may close it from here or you may close it from here anywhere you want so i close file number 1 which is a roll number then page number 2 is for office use only so don't do anything over here there is no need of opening this file for this is for office use only so we don't have to do anything with this so don't open it next one is a question 1a so you have to open the file question 1a so once you double click on it so file will open now the limits are set to this file as well as the rectangle is drawn so don't do anything with limit and rectangle you have to change the dimension style because dimension style is not set so you have to type dim style enter then modify the dimension style so lines here you have to change the extension lines color select color and select index color 9 over here then symbols and arrows so arrow size should be 3.5 text text height so it is 4 it is already mentioned and precision it is 0 okay so text height you can take keep it as a 3.5 primary units precision 0 okay close then you work on this file once your question 1a is over you close this file after 5 minutes you have to click on this save button remember that you have to save it after 5 minutes and after completion you should close this file similar thing you can do with question 1b question 2 and if you want to save any extra question likewise if suppose for in your test one we have question 1 a b c and you have to solve in it two so you solve 1 a 1 b after that you solve question 2 and you have more time available with you then you open this extra question file and here you have to solve that extra question and here you have to mention this question number so you have to double click over here so question 1 c you have to mention its name so keep this in mind when you solve extra question you should write its name over here then you can work on it as usual you have to save the file after every 5 minutes by using this save button or by using control s and after completion you should close it so one thing you should remember you have to open one file you have to complete your work in that file you have to close that file then you have to open next file you have to open one file only once don't open one file at two different locations in that case you are not able to save your work properly so these are the things that you should keep in mind after completion of work you just recheck your all your files then a lab assistant will convert your entire document uh into pdf you should check that pdf and then leave the classroom